So this lesson is the second part of the Carlton dance, also known as the Fresh Dance in Fortnite. So in the first part, we did the Carlton dance, looks like this. We did a lesson to it, as well as a practice. If you don't know what I'm talking about, then just click the links in the description to get to these videos. Okay, so now in this video, we're going to do the second part of the fresh dance, which I call the duck walk. Looks like this. So we're going to do a beginner's variation just like before, and we're going to make our way up to doing the full duck walk. Okay, so let's get into the steps to the duck walk. Footwork is just a simple step touch, but two times to one side. Step touch is a core dance move that I teach in my club dance for men programs. So you should definitely have it down. You should be able to do it automatically because we're gonna start combining the arms now. So the arms go in and out like this, elbows bent, make sure you keep them bent. Don't let them get lazy. In and out like that. So from an X, and then I guess you look like a W. That. So you're gonna step out when you have your arms, cross, out, cross, out, cross, out, cross. Just like that. So try it with me slowly on my count all together. Five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Good. So that was the beginner's version. Beginners, you definitely want to be able to do it like that seamlessly before moving on. Now, for those of you who want more, we're going to vary up our step touch a little bit. So instead of just stepping side to side like this, we're going to point out our foot like this and we're going to open up our body to one side, like this. Just like that. So you can take wider steps, but just make sure that your toes are pointing a little bit towards the side that you want to step towards. So like this. All right. So let's just do the feet first. On my count, slowly. Five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Good. Notice that when I change directions, I just kind of shift on the end foot. So it just kind of twists around so I can change direction. You're just pivoting on your toe like that. So try it with me again on my count slowly. Five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, 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 five, six, seven, eight. Good. You think you got that? Not. Rewind. Try it again. Otherwise, it's time to integrate the arms with that step. So, again, opening up your arms, the step. Bring them in and across as your feet come together. So, on my count, we're going to do this. And make sure you open up your body in that direction. It'll probably do that if you're thinking about your feet. So, on my count, slowly. Five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, 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 
five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Awesome. We'll practice it a little more in the practice, but it's time to move on to the next part. Okay, so if you feel like you got that down, then we're going to incorporate looking just like last time with the Carlton dance. If you wanna do it exactly like Carlton does it, you're going to be looking away from the direction that you're heading. This one's tough, so if you feel like that last variation was good enough for you, then you can end it there for the practices. But if you wanna learn a little more, then what we're gonna do is I'm going to look away like that. So this one's tricky because you're not looking in the direction that you're heading, looking in the opposite direction. And you also notice that I'm tilting my body so that my arms are not level like this, it's going like this. So a few things to think about. Again, I'm gonna show you slowly. I'm gonna look away and my body's tilting, looking down in a way actually. So if you're looking down in a way then your body should naturally tilt downwards. So let's try it all together slowly with me on my count. We're going to turn our body as we do the step touch. Look down and away from the direction we're heading and tilt our body. A lot of things, let's try it slowly. Five, six, seven, eight, one, two, Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Good. I think you got it. I'm not sure. Let's try it again. I'll try to count a little bit slower. Five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five. 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 Six, seven, eight. Good. So that variation is pretty satisfying, but we can step it up even more, just a bit, to do it exactly like Carlton does it, as well as the way it's done in Fortnite. So final variation, this one's tricky. This is why I call it the duck walk, because we've got this duck stance, this snowboarding duck stance going on with the step. So it looks like this. It's pretty tricky. So what's happening is that footwork's still going out to the side, but the rear foot is pivoting completely like this. So you come into this duck stance. So you're stepping out and pivoting. Step touch, like that. Same thing the other way, like that. It's pretty tricky. Let's just do the footwork. Don't incorporate the hands. Try with me on my count. We're going to step out and pivot on the toe each time. So the trailing foot always pivots on the toe as you step out. So we're gonna do it super slow. This is the trickiest move on my count. Five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, 
seven, eight, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Good. That was pretty tricky. Now I'm gonna get even trickier because we're gonna combine it all together and do it slowly like this. A lot of things going on. Again, I find this variation pretty good without looking and just twisting your body to one side. But, you know, for completeness, we're gonna do this final crazy variation. So once again, I gotta show it to you because I know it's pretty tricky. It's a lot of things going on. So, a few things going on that you think about and eventually you don't wanna think about it is we got the duck stand step happening. We got looking away, as well as tilting our body. So remember, we got a lot of variations. You practice the variation that's comfortable for you and build up to get to this point. Okay, so let's try this final combination with me slowly on my count. Five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, 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 five, six, seven, eight. Good. I know it was kind of tricky for you guys, especially if you're trying to incorporate looking, you can't actually see me. So you probably gotta try without looking first and just copy my steps. And eventually you wanna integrate looking away from the direction that you're heading. Okay, so thanks for watching this video. Don't forget to click like and subscribe and visiting pickupdance.com for more lessons. If you're ready to see the practice for this, then click the link in the description. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight.